my god <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god so yeah i really did it yeah i really slept on the wizards jordan 3 the, the true blue wizards or whatever yeah i really slept on those man yo yeah I just make my day so much easier for real because I'm not leaving on those. I'm not, man. I want two raffles, and I'm going to pick up my pair right now. I already have one here, but I'm going to go for my double up for sure. I don't know if I'm going to go for the third pair, at least not today. But if you're sleeping, I think I'm just going to wait to get them for a little bit on the retail. I'm already going to get my pair today on the retail because I have a Foot Locker card for a discount or whatever, and I'm going to use it on these bangers because i really love these and i'm gonna go to pick it up i just can't decide what shoes should i wear today should i go bretos or true blue ones since these are inspired in the true blue i think i should go to true blue you can slip all you want but me nah 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 i'm gonna pick up those babies and you're gonna come with me and it's a raining day but that's not gonna stop me from go to pick up that fantastic pair of shoes that you are slipping on because for real that shoe is very, very fire. That's why I'm loving um, 2023 because it's been the easiest year to pick up great shoes that I've seen in a good, good time. I mean, 2020 was crazy. Every single shoe was going sold out. But this year, dope shoes like this, easy to get. Really, really easy to get. In 2020, this will be an instant sellout. But I think I just gotta enjoy this this um, this moment. This is a time that you gotta use to pick up some good shoes to add into your collection. Dope shoes like this, oh man, I just can't do it. I just can't pass on them, like, for real. I, let me just keep walking because it's raining and I gotta get to Foot Locker as soon as possible. So, see you in a minute. And here we have the shoes sitting right here. Yo, these are beautiful. These are really, really beautiful. I really love this colorway. The Wizards Jordan 3, man. These are so damn nice. That 210 retail price is crazy, but here I have my pair. Let's see how they come. You always shake your pairs. Always, always. This one look good. This one looks really good. So let's go back to the studio. So I'm back in the studio and I'm really happy because I got the shoes as you can see, but there's something like I feel that I gotta talk about, man. I see that a lot of dope shoes are releasing this year, like really, really dope shoes. And yeah, I kept sleeping on, on shoes like these. Also, this is not only this year. Last year, we saw the release of the OG Jordan 3, um, the Fire Red, and these were really easy, easy, easy to get. These were sitting everywhere, everywhere. Even right now, they're super easy to get in um, the retail market because the retail value is not that high and this is a really really dope shoe this one was crazy to get this one was really really crazy to get i had to do a three hour line to get these and it was crazy it was really crazy to get these the resale value is not as high as people thought uh, that's why this shoe went sell out because uh, people thought that they could um get some profit out of the shoe but apparently not that much and that makes me happy as well because i don't like resellers i don't like resellers but at the same time i feel happy because it's really easy it's been really really easy for me to get shoes because there's a lot of dope shoes that i really like and it's been really easy to get like this the the wizards jordan 3 the true blue um wizards or whatever because yeah, this shoe is inspired in the, in the true blue, just that Michael Jordan asked to Nike or whoever designed the shoe to make some twist on this shoe to make them um, combine a little bit more with the Washington Wizards um, uniform. And that's why we have the copper on the, on the Jumpman instead of the red and on the eyelids as well. But this is essentially a true blue. On Sneaker Shop, they didn't call these shoes the Wizards, even though we know where these colors came from. They actually calling the shoe the True Blue. And at first, I thought it was a mistake. I was like, they probably thinking these are the original True Blue, but nah. Now, I, what I realized is, I mean, that's my opinion, but I think they um, didn't label these shoes as Wizards. 
just because they probably will have to pay um, some money to, to the Washington Wizards team. And they just decided to go with the name that they originally had for this colorway. But to me, it's just a dope shoe that I can't sleep on. Jordan 3 has grown up into my um, second favorite silhouette in sneakers, not only in a Jordan lineup, but in sneakers. Um, Jordan, Jordan shoes are my favorite anyway, but um, this one right here, oh, I'm so happy because everyone's trying to go for the Jordan 4 and I really like the Jordan 3s more than the Jordan 4. I still like the Jordan 4, but this not as much as the Jordan 3. The Jordan 3 just goes more with the way I dress. And this one in particular, I think it's a really, really beautiful shoe. The quality is really, really nice. Man, the quality in this shoe is amazing. And I ain't gonna sleep on these. Even here, when they mostly put um, synthetic leather, they put real leather, not extremely great leather, but it's um, real leather here as well. The elephant print cut, I love the new cut on the on the Jordan 3s. Uh, it's really close to the OGs. I'm loving it. That's, um, let me show you. We have the same cut in both of these, the Reimagine and the True Blue 3s. These are shoes that I'm extremely happy to have, even though this one doesn't have the the Nike Air on the back like the Reimagine has. I think it's, it's good, it's good. They, they, they could put it because Michael Jordan wore the shoe when he was in Washington Wizards and they could put the Nike Air, but there's something that happens to me that is that in Jordan 3s, I don't mind having the Jumpman on the back because it has Jumpman Air, not the Jumpman alone like the Jordan 4 has. But uh, yeah, it's just that. I think the Jumpman Air looks good in the Jordan 3 and that's why I don't feel that it's always necessary because the Jumpman Air just look that good to me. But this one is a really, really nice colorway. White, blue, the copper, I think make the shoe more wearable than the red dust for the true blue. We have the copper again on the outsole with gray and white. Really dope, really dope. This one has Jordan, not Nike because this one didn't have the Nike Air, as I told you. But this is a shoe that I'm super happy to have. I'm gonna go for another pair because I wanna have the perfect pair. And as usual, you can see the mismatch on the, on the elephant print. I think they are good like this. I don't know, man, but I want another pair of these. I just like them that much. Really clean colorway. And I'm gonna double up on these because that's what I do with shoes that I really like. I need a pair to rock and another to keep on ice. Guys, I know a lot of you slip. I know a lot of you slip. So I got to thanks to a lot of you for making the my, my, my life easier, getting shoes that easy. Oh, by the way, for those who didn't know, this is the box, really beautiful, matched perfectly with the shoe, blue, the copper jump man. I like it. I like this one a lot. So yeah, that just make my life so much easier and I got to appreciate you for that because you're sleeping on a lot of good shoes that I like. Like the one I'm wearing right now, this one. One of my favorite Jordan ones to cop this year. The true blue, the true blue Jordan ones, you feel me? What can I say? I'm a happy camper this year because I've been getting a lot of good, good, really good shoes that I really like. And that's all that matters to me, that I like the shoes. That's all I need to get the shoes, not anyone else's opinion. If I like it, I'm gonna get it. So guys, let me know your opinion about the issue. Did you get it or you slept on these? Let me know all that in the comment section. Probably that $210 price keep you away from the shoe. Me particularly, I get these on the retail. I get these for $190 because I use a coupon on Food Locker. But you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Um, but whatever, thank you guys a lot for watching. Just let me know if you got these or whatever in the comment section. Say whatever that you wanna say about the video, the shoes, just see you in the comment section. Also, leave a like, cause that's totally free and it's only gonna take a second of your time to leave a like on this video and help the channel so much with the YouTube algorithm. Go follow me on my Instagram and on TikTok for more sneaker content, sneaker pictures, sneaker news or whatever. It's Jason J Kicks on Instagram, same on TikTok. And till the next one, this is dope. This is dope. Goodbye.